हाय हेलो एंड नमस्ते फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल आर एस के कॉम्पिटेटिव वर्ल्ड फ्रेंड्स इन द लास्ट सेशन वी डिस्कस सिंग दैट इज ह्यूमन डाइजेस्टिव सिस्टम एंड पार्ट्स आल्सो वी डिस्कस्ड मींस पार्ट्स इन शॉर्ट वे दैट इज विच आर द पार्ट्स आर देयर इन द ह्यूमन डाइजेस्टिव सिस्टम लाइक बकल कैविटी देन आफ्टरवर्ड्स ईसो पैगस फूड फाइव देन आफ्टरवर्ड्स विल बी स्टमक देन स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन लार्ज इंटेस्टाइन रेक्टम एंड एनस सो that is in the last session uh, we discussed at the first point that is uh, where you will take the food we can call that is the ingestion mouth that is buccal cavity and if you divide the buccal cavity we have three parts in that which are those three parts first part will be teeth second part will be tongue third part will be salivary glands so in that we will discuss first time that is first uh, type is teeth do you know how many teeth we have right now so for that what you need to do just to uh, be in front of the mirror and just start counting okay so now i think uh, even the seventh standard means nearly you are in the age of 12 13 or 14 year with a below 14 years okay so just to start counting by standing in front of the mirror then count it how many you have okay so see uh, when you will that is when you will pass your adult stage okay so everybody will get 32 teeth 32 teeth means 16 will be in the upper part 16 will be in the lower part what we need to discuss today okay so teeth how it is helpful for us how it will be helpful for us because when you will have the food the food when you will be enter to the mouth that will be start crushing then who will crush it these teeth will crush it okay in various functions we have i uh, will be chewing will be grinding some teeth will be grinding some teeth will be piercing tearsing okay some teeth will biting then some te teeth will cutting so various functions they will do then only that complex food will be convert to a simple one not completely partially and little bit amount of saliva saliva will also be added to that food initially then afterwards that solid food will be converted as a semi solid food what we discussed last time okay that's why teeth are very important doctor will also suggest you that he will uh, uh, whenever will uh, met the doctors the dental doctors the dentist what he will inform you that so we need to brush two times daily mornings session and in that is in the night session when you will have food after that because no sugar content should be there in our teeth if the sugar content if it is present on the teeth then what happens that sugar will be converted uh, will be eaten by the bacteria which are present in the on the teeth and will start decaying the teeth or tooth got my point are you getting my point so teeth is a plural form of a tooth so tooth is a singular teeth is a plural got my point so here that's why from today onwards all children you need to brush your teeth two times morning session and after having your that is the meal in the night time got my point so we'll discuss today about the teeth so totally in our mouth we have four parts that is in the in a teeth i am discussing teeth we are dividing as a four types which are those first one is incisors second one is canines third one is premolars fourth one is molars got my point first one is incisors second one is canines third one is premolars and fourth one is molars here in your textbook table number 2.2 that they have given type of teeth number of teeth lower jaws upper jaws and total they already have given the answer here incisors in the lower jaws will be four and the upper jaws also will be four means totally we have eight canines in the lower jaws we have two in the upper jaws we have two totally we have four premolars and molars we have 10 in the lower jaws 10 in the upper jaws totally we have 20 if you count these all if you count these all you will get here a 32 here 8 plus 4 is 8 plus 4 is 12 12 plus 20 will be 
32 32 if you divide upper jaws as lower jaws you will get 16 each so then well that is the upper jaws will be 16 and this lower jaws also will be that is 16 so each part will contain 16 each of these teeth got my point in can here see here the picture also so if you start counting here 16 teeth are there then where will be the incisor where will be the canines where will be the premolars uh, where will be the molars so here see guys here first four part can you see this one two three four these are incisors what is its function these teeth will cut the food and bite the food got my point they will cut the food and they will bite the food this is the function of these incisors so next one will be see this next one will be see this is a uh, besides of these incisors we have canines can you see this besides of incisors we have canines this side these are called canines and their function is to pierce it and to tear it the food which is cutting after biting with these the function of these canines will be the piercing that food and tearing the food and these canines will be very besides of these incisors got my point besides of these incisors which is there in the lower side means lower jaws also and upper jaws also the position of these incisors canines molars and premolars are fixed in the upper jaws also and lower jaws also please keep in mind okay so uh, besides of these besides of these canines we have premolars can you see this one they have given here premolars got my point and not only this one this side also these are the these are all the premolars okay okay you can count here this side also premolars and this side also premolars upper jaws we have four lower jaws we have four this side we have two this side we have two here this side two and this side also we have two means upper jaws we have four and lower jaws also we have four got my point yes so what is its function piercing and tearing and besides of these premolars in the last part will be the molars what is its function the same function of the premolar that is what is that chewing and grinding chewing and grinding both will do the same function these premolars and molars will do the same function that chewing and grinding they will start chewing it then afterwards grinding it and convert completely that com complex put into simpler one with the help of saliva eh, with the make that solid food into semi-solid food which is further will be very important for the digestion process which will be passed to the esophagus we can call them as a that is food pipe okay so this is what uh, regarding the teeth how many we have totally 32 we have in the upper jaws we have 16 lower jaws we have 16 so if you ca count these in the incisors in the lower jaws also we have four Lo the upper jaws we have four totally eight canines we have in the lower jaws two upper jaws also two totally we have four premolars and molars including totally 10 plus 10 will become a 20 if you count these all it will become a 32 and after when you will cross your adult stage after 20 22 24 so you will get a these all teeth that is 32 not in the 22 20 year after nearby 27 28 you will get all these teeth okay so here the question arises so if you want to see this your teeth completely want to feel it that what you have to do is activity 2.2 they have given that is wash your hands properly look into your mirror and count your teeth how will you count just to have a do this activity take a an apple into your hand just to be in front of the mirror and start biting it okay then just to last start biting it then you can able to see which means which teeth are biting which teeth are cutting which teeth are piercing tearing and which teeth are grinding and chewing 
then you can able to find out which are depending on these functions which are acting as incisors which are canines which are premolars which are molars got my point so the teeth of an infant fall up by the age of 8 years got my point the infants means here just born baby means a small little baby when will get birth with the help of its mother fortus when it will come out of its mother fortus means mother uh, stomach the just born baby from that point from that day up to up to 8 years so that position uh, in the 8 year the the these teeth will be start falling we can call them as milk teeth okay so those milk teeth will be replaced by permanent teeth and these permanent teeth may last to throughout your life and fall off during the old age or due to some dental diseases so you can see in your house also grandfather grandmother how they are suffering whenever they were having their food so that's why you will uh, that is keep on giving them the liquid food you will prepare the liquid food for them because their uh, teeth are not properly they are strong and uh, because of their old age uh, the teeth completely they fall off or maybe one little bit two or three teeth will be present in the mouth because uh, within using the three or four teeth they can't able to uh, crush the food properly so that will become uh, again a health problem or health issue for them so that's why we will prepare the liquid food for them okay so that so this is uh, how we, have, we discussed that is about the teeth the types of the teeth how it will be uh, uh, doing their functions in the mouth so these are so thank you friends uh, keep watching my videos uh, subscribe share my videos to your colleagues and friends thank you so much